something fell out of the car when he opened the door. Looks like a road map. She's driving off so fast I won't be able to follow. But this is where my little gizmo comes in. Spidey's going to try and find out what's going on. It's not too hard to throw something at a speeding car and make sure you hit it. Not when you've got the help of your spider-powered muscles. Wow, he must have been in Miss Ampere's gym class. Look at those muscles. He's throwing the little robot spider right at the car. Bullseye! It hit the car roof, and the special adhesive I coated it with will keep it stuck there as long as I'll need it. Look at that. He'll always know where the car is. He can follow Doc Ock. And so, unaware of the strange object on top of the car, Betty Brant drives off into the night with her sinister passenger as our little cast of characters comes closer to their date with destiny. Stan Lee knows how to write, doesn't he? Makes it exciting. Meantime, it all happened so fast that I can hardly believe it. How could that have been my girlfriend, Betty Brant, at the wheel? Maybe she's on my mind so much that I'm just imagining I'm seeing her. Well, I better pick up this map. It may give me a clue. Come on, Spidey. Do what you do. It's a map of Philadelphia. And the car had Pennsylvania license plates. That must be their destination. Well, Spidey boy, it looks like you're going on a take a road trip, too. I've got to see this through to the end. Spider-Man's going to leave New York and go to Philly. Oh, exciting. I wonder if they'll stop by in Langhorn. Our scene now changes to the city of brotherly love, where we find an attorney visiting his client in jail. Well, Brant, did your sister do as I told her? I hope so, mister, for your sake. Don't worry, Blackie. She's probably driving Dr. Octopus back to Philly right now. Betty wouldn't let me down. She better not. That gambling debt you owe me is already past due. And you know what? My boys do to Welchers, don't you, Brant? I know. I know, Blackie. I've been your lawyer too long not to know. Oh, so this is Peter Parker's girlfriend's brother, the guy with the blonde hair. And it looks like he's got some gambling debts. So it looks like somehow they're forcing him to make his sister work with Doc Ock. That's not right. It's not respectful, not responsible. Definitely not safe to hang around with Doc Ock. I'll cancel the dough you owe me as soon as Dr. Octopus springs me from jail. And no sooner now get lost. I've got some thinking to do. Sure, Blackie, sure, I'll go. Hmm. Who'd have guessed that Bennett Brandt, top man in his class at Hoover Elementary and then Harvard Law School, would end up as a spineless flunky, a stooge for the most ruthless mobster in the East, all because I wanted easy money. What a joke. It's the hardest money anybody ever earned. And now I've involved my own sister in this mess. Uh, he's got some regrets. He's got some regrets. <laughs> 